Bull Sharks. I'm Lindsay. I'm Trish. And you're watching BBN News. Now today we have quite a few announcements for you guys, so we hope you pay attention. And for our first announcement, we'd like to let you know today starts this week after school, Monday through Thursday from 1.45 to 3.15 in the Collaboration Center. Teachers from each subject will be there and are willing to help. If you're interested and need a little extra push to meet your academic goal, stop by. Ms. Blackerter, Mr. Norby, Mr. Ramanak, and Mr. Lauber will be available, so take advantage if you need a little extra help. Just make sure you have a ride by 3.15. Now seniors, are you curious about when you can get all your graduation supplies? Get a graduation ring or cap and gown. Representatives will be on campus soon. Check it out. Seniors, welcome back to school. Hope everyone had a relaxing and productive summer and is looking forward to starting school again and all the excitement your senior year brings. We're here on behalf of our friends at Herf Jones, your school's official partner for all things motivation and recognition. From your official class ring to your grad supplies and cap and gown, we're here by your side to recognize your biggest achievements. Now that you are officially a senior, you are finally eligible to order your official graduation supplies and cap and gown. Later this year, you will receive information on how to order your grad supplies with your class. Stay tuned for more info and good luck for a great senior year. Now, if you're interested in a career in the legal system, enjoy drama and theater, or just really like law and order, Mock Trial might be the right team for you. Join the Google Classroom code down below or stop by Ms. Sinnott's room for more information. And maybe the legal system isn't your cup of tea, but if you legally want to be able to tackle someone to the floor, wrestling might be just right for you. That's right, our boys wrestling team is starting up, and if you're interested, they'll start by having an open mat. The season will be here before you know it. Start getting your paperwork into athletic clearance so you can actually participate. And to my ladies out there, if you want to take a shot at wrestling yourself, this is the first year of girls wrestling and we'd really like for you to join. Come out and make history as the first girl wrestler at Benita Springs High School. We are having open mats so you can come out and gain some valuable experience. If you are planning on coming out, get a friend to come out with you. The more Lady Bull Sharks we get out, the better we will be. We now turn to Marsha Foreman for our newest segment, Club Insider. Take it away, Marsha. Bull Sharks, get ready for an all new segment we are bringing to you this year. Club Insider will be a new storyline that will be giving you the inside scoop of each club, after school happenings, and activities. From some of our very first clubs started here at Bonita Springs High School to ones that we won't give away just yet, you'll get the hands-on scoop of everything you need to know. The first club we'll be taking a look at is the Creative Careers Club. I caught up with our own very special teacher host, Miss Bailey. Let's take a look. Creative Careers is a club that we meet on Fridays. It's an opportunity for all the students that are interested in creative careers, photography, video, graphic design, to all come together, work together, learn new things, and use the incredible equipment that we do have and the resources. With the academy and the club, I think it's a dual effort for the students to continue to get. They're getting real life experience. They're seeing and experiencing just how we, the teachers who have worked in the field, are getting this experience in preparing them for the real world. And it's not just for Creative Academy, it, it cuts across all avenues, whether you're presenting for, say, teaching or in, in just the company, you get a lot of skills that um, you wouldn't normally get in other classes. Thank you, Miss Bailey. It really sounds like a great way to top off a hectic week for a high schooler. We hope this was a great help to all who are interested and that many of you will take this as an opportunity to meet some new people, make unforgettable memories, and most importantly, have fun. Back to you guys. Thank you, Marsha. For a greater insight on one of our amazing clubs, we're excited to see more. And now, we turn to Bryson for our weather update of this week. Bonita Springs will be taking the punches this weekend, with chances of rain being 80 to 90 percent throughout the weekend and into next week. So make sure to keep an umbrella close when you go out this weekend. The hot summer trend will continue, with temperatures in the mid-70s and mid-90s. So expect a muggy and nasty weekend. The heat index is going to take it to another notch, with the temperatures feeling as if they're in the low hundreds, so make sure to stay hydrated. The hurricane season isn't over yet, with activity slowly rising with increasing water temperatures. So make sure to check your local news for any updates on the tropics. That's all for the weather today, Bull Sharks. Back to you, anchors. Thank you, Bryson. And now for our sports news. The Lady Bull Sharks continue their hot start to the season on Tuesday night with a 3-0 sweep of Everglades City at home. The Bull Sharks are now 4-2 on the season and 2-0 at home after taking down Mariner 3-1 last week. The ladies host East Lee Thursday at home at 7. 
as they look for their third straight win and fourth straight win in five matches. Check back to BBN for highlights and an interview with Coach Crib, though. The football team still looking for their first win as they head into the third game of the season against Cape Coral on Friday night. The Bull Sharks were great defensively in the opening game, but turnovers cost them. Now last week, the offense moved the ball, but the defense almost gave up 400 yards. So they're looking to put it all together this week. Check back to BBN next week for results from Friday's night. And again, the boys golf team stays undefeated by Downing Mariner 173 to 247 on Thursday night. Keegan McGinn and Aiden McGinnis both shot a 41 to lead the Bull Sharks as they improved to 3-0 on the season. They are back in action against North Fort Myers on Monday. Now that's it for the sports, and now it's back to the anchors. That's it for today, Bull Sharks. And remember, just keep swimming. swimming.